Today, August 20th, is the birthday of Daniel Thomas Dorsch. He would be 76, but died in the 2001 Navistar mass shooting at 52. Daniel married his high school sweetheart, and they celebrated their 30th anniversary just five days before his death. He loved baseball, including watching the White Sox, sharing the game with his son, and playing with a corporate team. After serving in Vietnam, Daniel took a job at Navistar on the recommendation of his dad, who had built a career there. He began as a line worker, but quickly worked his way up. Serving as a supervisor in the engine lab at the time of his death, Daniel was a 26-year employee known for his willingness to roll up his sleeves and work alongside his employees. Daniel was generous, often providing home-cooked barbecue meals for his employees, providing supplies for his softball teammates, and making time for anyone in need. His brother expressed the family's shock. You don't think it would happen to your family. It's very difficult. The shooter, a recently fired employee, was one day away from a five-month prison term for his role in a company theft ring. Wielding an AK-47, he killed four former co-workers and wounded four more before killing himself. He had renewed his firearms license two weeks before he was convicted of yet another crime, criminal sexual assault and mistakenly retained possession of multiple firearms despite being a convicted felon. 